everyone. Welcome to the Horror Show. I'm Brady Lee. I'm Ian Fuego here. Marcia Parker. I'm Cecil Laird, and we're back with another trailer reaction. This one is for one that, when it first debuted, was listed as a Hulu series. Then I saw some other people say it was no longer a Hulu series, so I'm not really sure if it's continued that or not. But in any case, it is something called When the Streetlights Go On, in the city. Season 1. <laughs> so, not in the city. Fuego <laughs> can't help but make stupid references. When the streetlights go on. Alright, shut up, and here we go. <laughs> Three, two, one, when the street lights go on, go. Stranger Things minus the paranormal? Mm, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm really into it. I got I'm into it too. No. I'm, okay. I, I felt like right. they were trying to capture that same type of vibe. The whole small town mm -hmm. is on edge. Because I, I don't care. Again, this is this goes to Marshall's desire for for you know true crime kind of stuff because this looks more like a. Straight, mm -hmm. you know, crime, you know, fiction, procedural, possibly. I don't know. piece, though, obviously, 80s. It didn't really feel horror until, like, the no. end, when they're, like, everything starts going on flames, and things are starting to heat up, and... Beautifully shot. They're probably gonna be more murderers and crime. I think it's gonna be more mystery thriller mm -hmm. than yeah. anything else, but... Mm -hmm. yeah. But nonetheless, it's, it's close enough, and again, you know, you guys, the reason these are... Uh, good trailer reactions is because we haven't watched them ahead of time, so we don't know if they're horror or not like sometimes. this right here is just like... There's a lot, yeah, I mean, that, that, there's, that's, that's terrifying. a scary scenario, <laughs> absolutely. So I'd be showed, terrified. <laughs> yeah, so they showed the pilot at Sundance, and now the series has been picked up by Hulu, I presume. Oh, is this or, a series? Yeah, again, unless they went back on it, that was a miss... Misreporting, or maybe not. The I don't director know. Director of Kurt Cobain. It wasn't that Kurt Cobain's daughter that directed the Kurt Cobain. The no, Montage, Montage of Heck. No. no uh, oh, she one. just produced it. I she don't know. They, there was a couple of them. It. No, there was a couple of Kurt Cobain. There was Kurt recently. and Courtney. There was Montage of Heck. Right. No, there Montage of Heck had stuff. something to do with his daughter for okay. sure. Either way, um, doesn't matter. This is, um, it, it looks interesting, although not entirely horror. So it looks very noir. Yeah, Brittany, what were your thoughts? Uh, it, to me, it looks like the the whole beginning story is not what the show is about. It's just the catalyst for whatever the show is about. Okay. Which I'm kind of curious to find out. That's fair. That's fair. True that. All right. Well, um, yeah. Why don't you guys let us know in the comments down below what you think of when the street lights go on. Um, does this look horror? Is this based on something? You guys always let us know because you guys tend to know more than us about certain things, especially comment, comment, novelization comment. sort of stuff. So let us know. We'd like to know uh, what you think in the comments down below. Until next time, I've been Cecil Laird. I'm Brittany Lee. Gracias, I've been Jaime Fuego. Marsha Parker. And remember, stay, stay scared. scared. Like, share, subscribe.